I notoriously overthink things. And that's quite a problem for me because I've been thinking about starting a YouTube channel for quite a while now. I had this, this idea, why not start a Diary of Creation YouTube channel, just a, a YouTube channel about macro photography and the things I enjoy. And I had that idea probably like two years ago. And I noticed that a while ago, that I, I, I've been overthinking this whole idea. So I thought, okay, screw all the thinking. Screw the idea of doing a YouTube channel. Instead, why don't you just make one YouTube video? I thought, hey, that's a really good idea. You see, if you just make one video, that should solve the problem, right? <laughs> no, it did not solve the problem. You see, now I've been overthinking that one video. Um, I've been planning and I, I think I even started drawing a storyboard at some point. Uh, I was wondering, could I borrow a drone from someone? How can I use my uh, DSLR? What prime lenses should I use? How can I get a cool cinematic looking video? Blah, 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 blah. And now I just thought, you know what? Screw it. I have this old camera. I'm just gonna start filming and see what happens. I have planned nothing now, but I do wanna go out. I wanna go out and shoot. I wanna find bugs and take some nice pictures of them. So I'm just gonna take you along with me. I don't really know what's gonna happen next. I'm just gonna get in the car and go somewhere and see what I find. And maybe I'll find something cool. Maybe I'll take a nice picture today. Maybe I won't. I don't know. Dare I say, I don't even care. <laughs> I just feel like doing this now. First things first, I need to pack my gear, which is what I'm gonna do next. I think I've decided where I want to go. There's a parking space um, right next to a forest, not far from here. And I think I'm just going to go there and then walk into the forest and see if I find anything cool, I guess. Let's see what happens. So I just kind of launched into this whole video thing uh, without thinking about it, which is good and healthy for me. Um, but I also realized I didn't tell you who I am. My name is Joe, by the way. Um, I have an Instagram channel called Diary of Creation, where I post insects and macro shots of bugs and spiders and things like that. And uh, that's where the idea came from to start the whole YouTube channel thing, which then turned into, why don't I just make one video and see where that goes? Anyway, um, I was thinking about something while I was driving here. I don't post things on the internet unless I'm actually happy with them. I have a, a very high standard for myself if I put anything out there, especially when I post pictures to Instagram. But then I realized something. At least I realized something on my way here. There's something worse uh, than posting content to the internet that isn't as good as it could be. And the thing that's worse is not producing content in the first place because uh, you want it to be so good that you end up not doing it in the first place. Which is what I've been doing for a long time. So I've decided not to do that anymore. I'm not going to worry about the quality of this uh, that much. You probably can't see it on this camera. There's a tiny wolf spider. I think it's a wolf spider. It's definitely a spider. Uh, crawling around here. I'm gonna try. And see if I can maybe get a shot. Even though I'm coming at a strange and awkward angle. Probably, I'd rather be on eye level. But I think I'm gonna have to go a bit more from the top. And he is in the sun which will make it a bit harder to get without the motion blur. But it should work.
I can see some hawk moths flying around here and there's one that's just sat down in the sun I don't think I'm gonna get a shot of this but it would be pretty cool if I could get one of these guys I don't know if you can see him he just sat down right there and I might get lucky this is probably a waste of time and energy but I busted out the big gun this is a 150 macro with a teleconverter um, making this a 300 millimeter 2 to 1 macro um, kind of crazy I know but I think I could get the hawk moth with this without scaring it away I wasn't sure if I was going to go out and shoot this evening and it's always worth it. That photo of the hawk moth is uh, something I'm very very happy about because um, I bought that teleconverter. I kind of just hoped it would work with the 150 macro without really trying it out. That was just really good. I'm really happy about that shot. Um, a hawk moth in flight with uh, no flash. That's something I've wanted for a long time and I just found it and got it. I can't believe that just happened. It worked perfectly. I am extremely happy about that shot. After moving up a little bit, I found this rubber fly in a patch of grass just sitting here on a single blade and I hope that I can get exactly this as a photo of maybe even um, a small stack three or four shots Okay, it's not a huge pile, but I definitely found a bunch of ants, and I'm not sure what they're doing. I think they're stealing something. Um, at least that's what it looks like. I don't know what's going on though, so if, um, if you know, why don't you write a comment and tell me? That could be helpful. I'm always interested to learn about the things that I shoot. Um, I tend to not know too much. I mean, I know these are ants, uh, but that's as far as my knowledge will go now. the second entrance um, to this little I don't know what to call it ant colony it doesn't really look like a colony but they are busy burrowing their way through this log at least and there's an entrance here where the ants are just moving along ever so slightly carrying things in and out and right here is an entryway which is perfect for a photo because the ants are just coming out over and over again so I should be able to set my focus at the entrance and then basically spray and pray and hopefully I'll get a nice picture of one of these ants Okay, 
my battery's dying. Um, so I'm gonna wrap it up now. All things considered, I think that was a very successful uh, evening. I'm very happy with the photos I've taken. Yeah, so it was, this was a very spontaneous idea, but it turned out to be a very nice idea. Um, I told myself I'd make one video, this has been one video. Who knows if I'll make another video. It was fun, so maybe there'll be more in the future. Um, I really can't tell. If you want to subscribe to the channel, um, feel free, do so. If not, then don't do so. Um, and also, if you want to follow me on Instagram, uh, then follow me on Instagram. Uh, I post a lot of pictures there, at Diary of Creation. Uh, one word, just look it up on Instagram and follow me. And I guess I'll see you next time, if there is a next time. Um, I need to move towards... Okay, the camera literally just died on me. Um, I was mid-sentence. I think I said, I'll see you next time, if there is a next time. Um, I don't know if there'll be a next time, but if there is, see you then.